So here we have the reverse V squat. So we're going to face inward towards the machine just so we could target the musculature of the glutes and hamstrings that little bit more. So as you can see, Clara's adopted a stance that's comfortable for her, which we've seen is just out hip width distance. From that position, a couple of coaching cues. She's going to focus on having a nice tight tummy. She's going to try and create as much tension in those hamstrings and glutes as possible. Now from there, our first intent is going to be breaking the hip while she breaks at the knee, dropping down, back, 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 pausing her roughly about this position here, initiating her glutes, clamping them together. I think she's trying to squeeze a credit card in between as she then extends forward. Coming back down, what we're going to do is just going to get our weight on the back of our heels. If it was to go more towards the toes, we're probably going to feel it more in the quads. But from there, driving from the heels back up. Now in this position at the top, it is quite an easy position. There's not much weight on the machine. So what you could do is you could have a band attached to something or even someone pulling it right on Clara's waist. So drop down for me. So as she would then drive back, it gets harder as she gets into hip extension. So there you have it, the reverse B squat.